this in this video we are going to see the uh, page replacement algorithm least recently used algorithm of demand paging so how we are going to replace what strategy we are going to adopt in this the name itself says least recently the one which is not used for a longer time uh, that is the one which is used minimum time that will be removed uh, that will be selected as a victim for page replacement so here the page which is not used for longest period which means its use is not uh, so far uh, uh, it is not used that much so that page has to be identified and has to be re replaced with the new incoming page so first let us explain that with the given string let us take these are the pages the string is nothing but page let us say this as a these are all pages so first let us consider only four, four frames are available so first time one it is a page fault since one is not there a page fault takes place and the page this first page will be loaded from the secondary storage device into this frame and so on so second three four all these are first time attempts so they will be page fault definitely takes place and they will be transferred from the secondary storage to main memory the frames in the main memory now so one two three four so four page fault next comes once again now it is already there so no page fault because it is already there so it can be executed then again a reference to page two takes place it is also already there now five is there okay so which has to be replaced uh, which page has to be replaced whether it has to replace one two three four among this which page has to be replaced so if you see that first it is loaded and then two three four then again a reference to this that is it is used least recent it is used now again okay. now two is also used again okay. reference again okay. now if you see these two this is the least recently because after this this is referred so this will be the least recently so that will be the victim and we replace five uh, for that and then uh, one one again it is uh, uh, recently used it is very recently used then uh, after one two again it is referenced then three now if you see that this is the this four is the least recent used among this so it is replaced with three and then again four is referenced again here if you see that one is referenced again two is referenced again three is just now has entered so it is also considered as a reference so now the victim is five so that will be removed and four is replaced in that then again five if you see that three four all recently only has come before one and two and if you see this two is the least recent before that one is different so that will be the oldest one so five is uh, replaced in place of one so how this can be implemented this logic so one thing is like a two way you can implement one is using a counter and another one is using a stack implementation we are going to see how both can be used counter implementation every page each and every page which has a counter every time page is referenced through this entry copy the clock into so what is the latest clock that will be copied uh, here when a page needs to be changed look at the counters to determine which are to change now uh, with this example i'll explain how to use the counter first uh, yeah uh, let me write the old data seven uh, i'll remove all these things So here, right. First, uh, we'll execute this uh, LRU page replacement along with the counter uh, for this string. So first, seven is referenced. So page fault takes place, and uh, that particular uh, page is uh, transferred from secondary to main memory. That is the frame in the main memory. Now zero, see this uh, zero. So now zero takes place. Okay. The first time reference, let us take. Uh, it starts from. One first time reference. Then this is this is the let us consider this as a clock. If a first second, second second, third second, and like that we can count. Then here one. So this occurs at the third second. Okay, we will keep it like that. Then two two is referenced. So here uh, these are the pages. This is only a counter. 
So two is uh, two is coming again. Now you have to uh, choose a page in such a way that least recently used. Now if you see that this is the least recently used because seven is the least recently used because that is the oldest. It 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 first occurred in the first second itself. Then so now we remove this and we select this as a thing and then we have to update. At this fourth second it has come. Two has come at the fourth second. Okay, first second, second second, third second. Let us uh, for some imagination we have to keep it like that because get okay, the clock uh, time will be noted here. So which uh, which is the old uh, clock time that will be taken as the uh, page for uh, replacement. So here one is the old clock. Let's take okay that will be selected. So that frame is selected for replacement, and here two is replaced here. Then comes zero. Zero is already there, but anyway, reference is made there. There will be no page fault. But since it is referred, now we, we increment this clock to five because after four, fifth count. Okay, then three. Three is uh, there here. It is three is not there. So we have to select the one which has the lowest clock. So now three is the lowest clock. So here we replace it with three and this clock also we make it to six because after six, the uh, previous one, this is for the uh, latest. So six. Then, so this is our uh, frame. And there is a page fault. Here the page fault takes place because three is smaller. So that is why we are replacing. Then zero takes zero reference. Zero is already there. So since it is referred, we increment this count. But it's the latest here, six. So after six, now it is referred. So we'll make it as seven. Then four. Fourth, when you search fourth, it is not there. So it, a page fault takes place and a page has a frame has to be found for replacement. So what is our thing which has the low uh, old clock value now here in this old clock value four is the old clock so in that we replace it four and then we increment with the latest clock which is nothing but after seven it is eight okay so this is our uh, let us take this as clock signals so eight then two comes so four zero three then two comes when two comes it is not that so again a page fault takes place which has the lowest six the previous one old uh, clock. So now it is replaced with the two, and then here we increment the count to nine because that is the least we, le, latest. Okay. Now next comes the three. Now we are here three. Here again three is not there. So now we find the lowest, which is nothing but this seven. So here we replace it with three, and here it is ten. Oh. Okay. So four, three, two. This one. Then zero. Again, zero is not there, so we select the victim here. Zero, and this we made it as 11. So 11 to count, 11 seconds we can have. This occurs before, nine is occurring, occurred before the 11 second and 10 seconds. So this is now oldest. So zero, here we are here. Then three, it is already there, but still it is referred. So we have to increment the count. 12, okay, then two. Again, two is reference, so we have to increment this code. It is already there, so no page fault, but it is let uh, recently it is referred, so we increment the code. Then one, one is not there, so we have to select. Now we'll select this because this is the oldest one. So this is replaced with one, and then the increment is made. That is, this is the latest uh, frame record, and the page fault takes place. Then two. Uh, here two is already there, so we just increment since it is already there, no page fault. So we increment just since it is referred, we increment the count. That is uh, one, three, two. So two we have seen. Then now here we are zero. So zero is not there, so we have to find which is that. It is nothing but this. So, so zero, we have made zero, 15. Now it is 16. Okay. Now so 102, this is the position. Then one is referred again here we already have. So the 16, it is 17. Uh, so one is also over. Then again we are referring seven. If you see that seven, here it is not there. So now we select this because this is the oldest uh, second. So now we take seven. Here we replace this and we increment this. 
with 80 and then again 0 comes when 0 comes it is already there so after 18 it is 19 then 1 comes when 1 comes it is also already there so now it becomes 20 so uh, according to this referencing this has been made so the counter is used to keep track uh, which is the oldest page uh, present in there if a page is referenced again automatically the count is incremented so the least recently page uh, that is very uh, the page which is again and again referenced uh, it may not be removed that uh, earlier like in the fifo so this is how by maintaining the count uh, the LRU page replacement takes place by using the counter. So it has 12 page faults because 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. For the same thing in FIFO, we have uh, 15 faults. You see that here we have 15 page faults. And in optimal page replacement, we have nine faults because in this we should have a prior knowledge or future knowledge about when the page has to be referred. If it is not going to be referred uh, in near future, we can replace it. So that knowledge must be there. That is the disadvantage in this also. So nine faults. Here in the LRU, we have 12 faults. So it is better than the FIFO. Then using the stack implementation. So how it can be used? We'll see that. Uh, first we'll see that, then we'll come to this point. It's a disadvantage. So let us take this string, how it is going to keep track, how the stack is going to be used of uh, keeping track of, which is the least recently, or uh, which is the latest. This is the old, latest used, and how it manages to uh, find a victim page for replacement. So let us take this four, okay? In frame, it will be uh, as usual, uh, three frames, all those reference will be there. No, uh, first we are referring four. So that will be added into the queue. So it will be pushed into the stack, sorry, not queue, stack. Then reference to this is seven is coming. Then that also will be pushed into the stack and then zero is coming. Now that also will be pushed into the stack. Now again, seven is made. The one which is referred will be brought to the top of the stack. That is the logic here. So if you see that, see here. Now, uh, 470, 470 are pushed. Now again, a seven is, uh, reference is made. Now this seven, the one which is referred will come to the top so that zero goes down okay now zero goes down and seven has been brought to the top now after this it will be because it is again so uh, it will be taken from the middle and then it will push as uh, it, it will be pushed at the top of the stack then again one is referred it is not at all that so now that will be pushed into the top of the stack the one which is not referred uh, that the first time occurring that will be pushed into the stack now then zero zero is coming it is already in the stack so what happens this will become the top of the stack it will be removed and pushed. so the lee uh, uh, the one which is used again and again will find its place in the top of the stack so uh, the one which is at the bottom that will be considered as the not at, uh, very least recently used so that will be the victim so for example that will be the victim to be removed from the stack so this way it keeps let us see the other things also so here zero is referenced so it has come to the top again one is referenced so now one becomes the top now i just replace here seven just like push it then one yes now after that it will the stack will be like this so zero one we have seen and then two Two is not at all that, so we push into the stack. Then one, again this one, what will happen? It comes here. This two goes down, and then because of this first one reference, it again comes to the top of the stack. Then two, two is reference, so it comes to the top of the stack. So one goes down, 
and here two. Then now here, if you see that this is what our uh, stack which is given in this picture according to that. Then uh, at this point the stack appears like that. Then seven is pushed again. Uh, now seven is referenced. So what happened? This seven will be taken and it comes to the top of the stack. Okay, then one. Now again, this one will be taken and it comes at the top of the stack. Then again, if it is reference is two, first I'll push it, put it down, move down, then only. Yes, now again two is reference, so this uh, two will be taken and it will be here. So if you see that the four is the least recent, four is not at all referred again. So this will be taken as a victim and this page will be, four will be removed from the main memory. And then in that place, the new incoming page, uh, page will be placed. So what is the drawback in this? Here yeah, the stack is a good thing, but in order to uh, implement the stack, we use uh, doubly linked list will be a better one because we have your, uh, we, I have told you it is taken from the middle. Normally in stack, we use only top pointer to uh, remove as well as insert. But here uh, at the bottom, it will be the law, the, if you are going to implement as a doubly linked list, the last linked list, the last list will be used for, considered as a removal. That page will be consciously removed. Then, if you are in the middle, any reference is made, that middle will become the top again. Okay, so all those manipulations can be done only with a, it will be done very easily with a W because it can move forward, backward. So, we can use the W link list for that. And then, uh, so page references move it to the top. It takes six pointers because in W link list, we have uh, two pointers, actually, four pointers manipulations if you are going to insert or remove anything because the previous uh, the w pointers it has the uh, uh, forward link as well as backward link link to the next list so in those list also the pointers has to be manipulated if it is going to be removed so four pointers and then top pointer and as well as the bottom pointer so tail that also has to be manipulated. So totally six pointers, any change, six pointers has to be changed. Then bottom of the stack will be the LRU, that is victim on the one which is at the bottom because the one is a reference again, again, it finds its place and up, the others are pushed again. So the one which is at the bottom will be the victim for replacement. So no search for replacement. Here one advantage is there is no, no need for searching. Because always the last element is going to be the replacement. So we are not going to search here. Just like in our, uh, the one which where we are using the Chrome. So here there is no searching the whole stack so that uh, which place, which page has to be replaced. That problem is not there because always you can find the page to be replaced. Information, you can find it at the bottom of the stack. 